three, four. A little bit damaging. So march for three and a heel dig. Good. So yeah, I'm kind of getting there with my structuring. But as if you've listened to that live, I think most of you have. I don't have any halls in September for the evening. So I'm taking evening sessions, uh, doing something a little bit different. So just bear with me, it'll all work itself out. You know I won't let you down. Bring it up. Little treble. Good. So just crunching that knee. We got some sunshine today. After all that rain yesterday. Yeah. Uh, what am I doing with those arms? What am I doing? I can imagine you now in that front room. <laughs> arms everywhere. Four more. Three. Two. Stay with the knee lift. There, with a crunch. I'll tell you what I am going to try and do for the online moving forward. Hey Julie, hey Amanda. Is I'm going to try and categorise all the workouts so far. So I'm going to try and put all the strength into one section. How long does it going to take me? All the cardios, all the pilates. So moving forward, you've almost got a library of classes work with as well, rather than trawling through everything. Arms up. But I will work all of this out, don't you worry. Give me a side lunge. So if you've just joined, oh dear, she's out living today. See what I come up with. Yes, just side tap. Stay here, pull that knee in, keep that supporting knee soft. Another eight. Go back to those single knees. How's that shoulder, Amanda? Is this the one that you should be doing? I'll think about some improvisations. Hold and repeat. Going. I'm full of chat this morning, aren't I? Must be that coffee I just said. Another four. Hold your squat. There in the centre. Can you push your shoulder down? So twist. Come up. Yeah. Morning, Marie. Morning, Liz. Oh, God. GCSEs. It's got to be the better choice now, hasn't it, that they can get their teachers to grade them? It's such a bloody shambles, isn't it? Hold your squat. Marie, how's that inner thigh doing? Let's do some little stretches for that as well. So just step out and out. Not too deep. Good. So I'm actually having to do a really quite in-depth business plan this weekend to move forward. I'm going to do a little survey. I just want everybody's response. It is so hard, honestly. Anyone with their own business will know how tough this is to go try and coordinate with the changes. Oh my word. Stay here. Stress levels 
are in the room. Good job I've got you lot to keep you safe. Keep lunging. I really appreciate all your lovely comments, by the way. Good. Stay low. Here. In the thigh stretch. Hold it. Other side. Should be feeling warm. Center bend. Push. We're lengthening out those hamstrings there. Well done, okay. Two exercises, so one exercise, we're gonna repeat it three times through. Then we're gonna move it on. Okay, so, a little bit of overload. The exercise I might tweak slightly as I go. So let's start basic, shall we? Right, I'm using my clock here for my timer. Okay, so we're gonna go for a basic squat. Just roll those shoulders back. Good, so squat down. There, that's all we're going for to begin with. Still kind of getting warm. Yeah? Excellent, keep sitting back in the heels. So you're doing about 50 seconds on each exercise. So it's just slightly wider than your hips. This is gonna get your legs warm really quickly. Oh, keep it up. Almost there. 10 seconds to go.
Good, keep putting one. Come on, you've got five, four, three, two now. Upright row, shoulders. How's that? This is your second block. So we're tweaking every move. Obviously, I've got slightly lighter weights at the moment. Remember, I'm trying maintaining here for me. Oh, come on. Push. It should be working up a sweat. Ten seconds. in a squat with that upright row. Now, the toughest way is to upright and squat at the same time. There. So I've turned my toes out, but if you want to do one hip each, then your wide squat. So you choose, or both together. Good. Or one at a time. Squeeze those knees back. So again, you should feel a little bit of work there. Stretching those inner thighs, Marie. Hopefully you feel that. So strength training, we know mindset-wise, and I think most of you have got your head around this, strength is so important, just as important as your cardio. It's better than another. You know, you have to consider so many things. Keep going. And recover. Okay, next block. I'll come back to that. Okay, so let's go into lunges. Step back right leg. Tuck under. Basic weighted lunges to start. Here we go. Drop. So it's just static. Shoulders back and just keep going there. So we're keeping it really basic. You get so many things to consider when it comes to fitness. You know, you may need to adapt your exercises. We spoke about injury. Marie, we've spoken about that. You know, definitely when you hit 40 plus, 50 plus, you've got to change the way you exercise. You've got to listen to your body. It's all about energy out versus food in. It's going to keep you fit. And if it's weight loss, simple as reduce your calorie intake and up your exercise. Whether that's walking, running, weights, that's the way it works. That is the way it works. So recover. And definitely for someone like myself, preaching, preaching, change leg, about how you've got to change what you do, your lifestyle with age. Let's go lunge this side. Not to harp on about age. But you definitely need to go with what your body is telling you. Good. And that's why I've taken down my weights a bit recently. I'm doing more standing teaching when I'm doing my outdoor sessions. You can still deliver a good session. Because I'm chatty this morning, aren't I? Keep going. Looking forward to seeing some of you in the flesh in September. Two more. Recover. So, where can we go with this? Alternating lunges. I'm going to take them forward. There. So, forward. I've just got a bit wide on my lunge, because they're fast. The lunge almost becomes a one-legged squat. Good, keep going. Four, three, two. 
Well done. Okay, back to just upper body. You can march or standing. Roll the shoulders. Exercise one. Together. Do it again. So, singles. I'm just going with my shoulder niggle in a minute. Double. And again, singles. Double. So wide. There we go. Single. Come on, keep that shoulder down. White. And again. Single. There we go. Squeeze it out. More leanness. Singles. Together. Squeeze. One more set. Remember, neck is back, neck is long. Together. And roll. Second set. We tweak it. We go from wide to narrow. Here we go. So single. Double. And again. Single. So we got a squat coming in at the end. Still with that front raise. So it's just taking it up another level there. Remember, slowly down. I've got no weights, remember. I've got no weights here. So two singles. 20 seconds left. So you really got to keep that control. Knees are soft. There. Breathe it out. Come on, we got to get back in the zone, everyone. Some of you have been away. Some of you are away, I know. Let's work our way up to September. When we can come back and do a little bit face-to-face. -face. It's going to be so good. Last one. Shake. Last exercise. Put one of your weights down. Stick with the front raise, we're going to pistol squat. Here we go. So remember, you are sitting deep into this squat. Again, I've got a fairly light weight so I can go faster. You might need to go much slower. How are we doing? Fee, how are you? Good to see you all. So this has got no impact at all today. It is all strength. I mean, I'm still sweating. Yeah, just remember how switching things up is going to really benefit because what you're doing is you're working all your muscle fibers. You've got slow and fast twitch. So we need to be working all of those muscle fibers to get that body strong. The stronger you get, the more you're going to be able to perform in your other fitness. And shake. Likewise, come down on the mat. Doing your cardio, the stronger you get in your cardio, the better you're going to perform in your strength because you've got more stamina. Everything goes hand in hand, as does your core work. So just really think about that when you're switching up your fitness sessions. Don't always do the same thing. Okay, we're ready. Press up section. Anyone who can't do press ups, lie on your back and give me slides. So drop forward. We start on the basic press up. So drop, lift. Knees on toes, push. So, I should have zoomed this this morning so I could turn in such a chatty mood, aren't I? Should have zoomed it. There we go. Keep pressing. So press, push, push. 
Need that strong push. Push it away. Breathe it out, everyone. Breathe it out. Keep going. You've got 15 seconds left.
triceps. I'm going to come here with them, with one dumbbell. Then I'm going straight to my kettlebell, the bicep curls. Roll the shoulders. Here we go. Squeeze those elbows in tight. So elbows out behind. There. Come on, you can do this. Keep it up, keep it up. Who else we got on? Amanda, sugar. Amanda, I've forgotten your flipping shoulders again. Apologies. This can't be good for you, this one. Bless you. So much going on. Keep going, guys. Keep going. Where's that gone? I always think about doing the cardio 
I need to have a chat with you to see where the needles are because that could aggravate it also. Okay. just sent me what she just sent me is that a picture of little one Do like a bit of ad-libbing. 
Change legs. Hold on to the lower arms, bend the elbows. Separate, shoulder blades. When you are ready. Abs to finish. Three exercises. You can use your weight either with a leg drop and weight extended or just up. You can do a leg extension, next level. Or you can do double leg extension. Are you ready? Here we go. Either extend or keep the bent. Or double leg. Thank you. 
I know. Well, I hope you enjoyed that. Let me turn the music off. 